I'm back with another video. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share if you're new to this channel. And if you're not trying to subscribe, shout out, you know what I'm saying? So today, we're back with another bang, spicy hot video. So today, we're doing the part two of what will you do if you find out your best friend is dating your ex, you know what I'm saying? So please subscribe, like, and share, and comment there. Let's go. Bro, I feel like the house was spinning, bro. Like I was teasing and like. Oh, men who, men who, men who? Are you no. there? Are you there? No, I'm not a whole man. Like we were dating for a year and never saw each other the entire year. So today I'm asking this lady, what are you gonna do if you find that your best friend is dating your ex? My ex? Yeah. Did I give a fuck about the ex? Like if I cared about the ex, yeah, then you, I'll have a yeah, conversation. Yeah, you did care. That means she's not my best friend. I'm not gonna do shit. That means she's she gonna leave her like that. Yeah, that means there's a best friend. There, yeah, honestly yeah. speaking. Okay. What would you do if you find that your best friend is now dating your ex? Well, probably beat her up. That's what I would do. And what do you benefit after that? Nothing, cause I just beat her up. That's that's yeah. That would like satisfy me. I don't drop. What are you gonna do if you find that your best friend is now dating your ex? He's your best friend, Nanke. <laughs> Who's your best friend here? She's my sister. <laughs> your sister. So what are you gonna do if you find that your sister is dating your ex? Nothing. Have I enjoyed it? No. Cause I'm I'm too lucky and we're taking, we're moving on. You don't mind? Nah. You want to go to the next one? Nah. But it was excellent. I'd be like, hey, like, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? Why are we fighting? Poor nigga on top of that. With something oh. hanging in between the legs. You, 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 you. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, oh shit. <laughs> eh. oh. It always deep the side. Mm -hmm. But there's nothing we can do, Vel. No, accept her. And move on. Yeah, and move on. Move on. And move on with mm. life, right? Mm. What are you gonna do if you find out your best friend? Your best friend, right? Is now dating your ex. Depends on the ex. Yeah. If it's like if, if you're the, that serious, the, the, the serious person that. One. I feel like I'm a, I'm a be mad. Obviously. I'm a be mad. And do what? Only be Just mad. Confront her. Like, why is she dating and my ex? Sex. Like, why? Because Upset I it? like him. Hi, Bo. <laughs> <laughs> you Because you like him? No. But, guys, um, yeah, I would be mad. But, guys, you don't know uh, who's your, your, your soulmate, right? What if the guy is your soulmate, my friend? And now I'm pushing you away from him. What if he's the one my show me for you, Wabo? So yes, I'll be mad, but I'll try to understand. For a man, let's say that you had like two year relationship with this guy, and then now I come guys. as your best friend. I've been with you through everything that the guys put you through, yeah. and then I go and. It's date not him. going to be easy, yeah. But guys, this is life. You never know who your soulmate is. What if your soulmate is the person I'm dating now? You don't know. So why not try it out? <laughs> yeah. So you're cool with that? Nah, not thing. on my side. It depends on the ex. And then if it's like a serious person mm -hmm. that I had a relationship with, I'm gonna be mad. For, mad yeah, I'm gonna be mad. And then when? You're gonna be mad and be fine. I'll be oh. mad and yes, I'll be mad for like some time, but I have to accept it. I'm not married to the guy. We move on. You know it's his saying? decision. He knows that you my best friend. Why is he coming for you? What if when you went for him? Yeah. What if, what if I did you what? Went I went for him. So what if you liked him? Ha, I'll tell my friend no to me pega up and chanwam. Ya konda ba man. Ndifuna kwenza into. Yeah, like to me I'm trying to explore. And then the I'll just show my friend oh, no, don't worry, get payback to me. I'm going. <laughs> Hi, hi, whoa, 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 this is too much, I can't handle it anymore. What will you do if you find out your best friend, your nigga, your real OG, sure. is now dating your ex? Ah, Joe, wrestling, it will be a wrestling match, I'm hey. sure it will be a wrestling hey. match. Hey, a <laughs> no, boxing match. Is, no, the thing is, me and that nigga were very close, yeah. and she knows how I love my ex. Yeah. So if you did that, ah, Joe, it's a low blow. 
you will smash the nigga. Yeah, I'll smash the nigga. Hey, they'll kill you, my brother. If you're watching this video, they'll <laughs> smash you. What will you do, ne? Yeah. If you find out your best friend is now dating your ex. I don't ask if he's on drugs. You, 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 you. <laughs> if I'd ask her, no, because we're not even into the same thing. Yeah. With men and women, we're, like, we're not into the same thing. So I know she, I'd know she'd be on drugs. For me, you know, we all have like three plus soulmates in the world. Yeah. Look for the other one, not my crush, <laughs> not my ex, not my ex. So what are you going to do if you find out he's dating your ex boyfriend? Look, a best friend. if they're dating, then I'm just gonna leave it alone. Like, if she's happy, then good. But I'm not gonna be friends with you. You know that so I have my boundaries. So the, the, the friendship is gonna be done after the relationship yeah. continues. Yeah, unless we like fix it in the future. Like, somehow future, she fixes it. In heaven. Yeah, like maybe I'll be mad at her for three Why months. Why would you date a homie hopper though? Huh? Why would you date a homie hopper though? Bruh, that's a problem. Yeah, we don't date homie hoppers. I, nah, can I ask this question? Did you drink too? Oh no, I don't drink. No way. She doesn't drink. She do not even wine. I had two shots of vodka. Well, not vodka. But tequila? Tequila. Tequila. Tequila, vodka. I had a lot of things. What is the craziest thing you've ever done for your ex? The craziest thing? I don't know. I guess, I guess staying with him for a year even though he was in a different province like how like we were dating for a year and never saw each other the entire year so that, after two that, years that we was a together, waste of your time exactly eh? but waste you know time. it is what it is the craziest thing you've ever done for your ex <sighs> the craziest thing i've ever done for my ex was um i've like i've once helped him but it wasn't the craziest thing no. mm. i think it was kind it was kind eh? mm. but i still hate him you, 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 you. That's one thing. Wow. Oh. <laughs> I'd kill him. For I was sure. about to say some nice thing, but I. It's fine. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's fine. Please subscribe, like, and share, and comment. Thank you for being in the video, eh? Craziest thing you've ever done for your ex? For my ex? Who's starting? Um, craziest thing I've ever done. The ex you ever loved. The one you've been with for years. Oh. I remember what I did. Yo, it was very stupid. But guys, primary school, you can't marathon. Wait until there's a stage. But then it's fine. What happened? <laughs> what happened is, so like, it was his birthday and I was like super broke, like a week before. I was got broke and I was like, I typed a letter to my parents that I have a school trip. Mm. Give me money. Sure. And then I bought him like gifts and whatnot. And then on his birthday, his maddie comes to school, gives him gifts. That time I lied to my parents for age. Oh, I'm going to a school trip for, to buy him gifts and then Man, boys, mashima niki scam, mojolo ki scam, ne guys. Must be easy. Just have fun. Don't laugh, thing. Lisaliba na. You hey guys, lagato is important. Love. I'll be saying this because she thinks someone is going to be watching. He's not going to watch, my friend. Be yourself. Don't be fake. <laughs> I don't remember, me. I know you know what she has done, but it's like no, she. <laughs> no, it's okay. my friend. No, nothing from me. I don't remember for The craziest thing you've ever done for your ex. I, Let me start here. Let me start here. I I know I don't think I ever done anything that crazy. Yeah, man. No. You never bought him anything. I bought him. I'm a regular district. Anything crazy. Anything crazy. No. So done for my ex. The mm. craziest thing I've done for my ex mm. was pawn my laptop go cash crusaders. <laughs> but real. <laughs> Young Palahira, since I'm blockila from that day, I'm still thinking, eh? Ah, eh it, means, it, it means she has a lot. Shoes. But that's not the craziest thing. Yeah, yeah. Craziest. I'm not sure. <laughs> you have a lot, ne? No. <laughs> I only bought shoes. Shoes, ne? Yeah. Guys, just buy your boyfriend some nice shoes, little shoes, you know what I'm saying? Can you do regular The Air Force. Air Force? Yeah. Say, it's a guy. Go, go, go sports scene or go. Sports scene, what's going on? I bet 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 I 
thing is, I'm not a crazy person, so everything that I do is within the land. So I don't know what. So like, like, what did you buy? What did you buy for her? Like, the craziest oh, thing you say you bought for her? I uh, took her to dinner. I bought her once underwear, g-string. Oh, there. Yeah. I think that's the craziest. Yeah, I bought yeah, her g-string. So, what is the craziest thing you've ever done for your ex? For my ex. And for your crush. Okay, for my crush. Maybe memorize his schedule. <laughs> X. <laughs> my X or crush? crush? No, crush for my school. At my school, I memorized his schedule, probably, yeah. And then for your ex? For my ex, um, I don't really have an ex that I have a problem with because I dump everyone, so. She dumps everyone. So, it's probably the craziest thing you've ever done for your ex. Uh, nothing! <laughs> She literally, she literally hasn't even like fallen in love with someone and has her heart broken before. So, she is a Russian tank. If relationships was an alcohol, yeah. she'd be a re- Russian tank. So, I'd be Kavassier if she protects herself. Okay, she protects herself. I bet. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for reaching this five. If you're new to this channel, you know what to do. Lit.